Jupiter is the largest planet that can be found in our solar system. It has a diameter of around 90,000 miles or 143,000 kilometers. This is over 11 times the diameter of Earth, and has a volume of over 1,300 times that of Earth's. In fact, Jupiter is so large that every other planet in our solar system could fit inside it. Jupiter is a gas giant and this means the majority of its atmosphere is made up of mostly hydrogen gas and helium gas. The planet is covered in thick clouds and is known for its great red spot. This giant spot is actually a storm that's been spinning for over 350 years. Recent studies however have shown the storm is decreasing in size, and some scientists have said that it could disappear within the next 50 years. It's also known for being a windy planet, having wind speeds reach up to 400 miles per hour. Although Jupiter is perhaps best known for this red spot, is also known for its colourful storms. Jupiter produces some of the most impressive auroras our solar system has to offer. Going back a few years ago, NASA captured one of Jupiter's most impressive auroras. They are much bigger than Earth's and also produce thousands of times more energy. Another interesting thing about this is Jupiter creates its own auroras. Earth doesn't create its own. Instead, Earth's auroras are created by solar storms. One of the reasons that Jupiter can do this is because of its strong magnetic field. This allows it to grab charged particles from its surroundings. These auroras were first picked up on when the Voyager 1 spacecraft passed by Jupiter in the 1970s. You would think that this would be a rare occurrence, but astronomers said during a 2007 press release that they were so frequent that every time they looked at Jupiter through a telescope they could see the auroras. Currently, we have the technology to search for other exoplanets, and that makes it a lot easier to find other possible Earth-like planets. However, this is easier said than done. There are hundreds of billions of planets in the universe, and trying to find a planet that is Earth-like is no easy task. Currently, we can only search for suns of life that are in the Milky Way galaxy. According to the research that has been published in 2015, Scientists said there were many larger galaxies that might be producing a greater amount of Earth-like planets. At the moment though, the next candidate for colonization will most likely be Mars. Although this planet is close by in terms of the universe, it's still a big leap forward for humans. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Thank you.